with another video and today's video is going to be a type of sketchbook walkthrough. Um, I've gone through a lot of some uh, Bristol paper so I figured I'd go over everything that I've done that is loose paper in the past couple of months. Uh, so there's going to be two parts to this one. The first part is now. The next part will be in the next video which will be a bonus video today because I haven't uploaded in a little while. I've been struggling with a lot of things personally, so that is my, that's why you haven't seen a lot from me. Um, I do hope you enjoyed this video, so let's jump right into it. Alrighty, so let's get right into it. Like I said, uh, this is kind of a Sorry everyone. Kind of a sketchbook walkthrough. I'll be going over some uh, pieces that I finalized that aren't in sketchbooks uh, that I've done in the past couple of months that I can't put in a portfolio right now because I don't have any. So let's just jump right into it. Um, so this is, I believe, the Bulbasaur uh, Trio, so all its evolution that I did during uh, live streaming, when I first started my live streams, uh, traditionally. So this piece is Bulbasaur. You got, oh my god, I'm having a blank of memory. I should really write these down. Ivysaur and Beansaur, which I was actually, I love this one, but I was actually really upset about it because I, completely left out the ears. Uh, the way I seen it was I drew them in the way that I think would fit real world or fantasy wise. So I had done them as elves and I forgot the ears. I'm so sad. <laughs> um, and now this is the, uh, the uh, Squirtle family, the three evolutions. I did this during stream as well. So you got Squirtle, War Turtle, and Blastoise. So here is Squirtle. I went more with a human-like but mermaid-esque type of look for it. War Turtle, and then Blastoise. Um, I do plan on redoing them and then maybe making them into a coloring book type thing for line art. And then you got the Charmander family and you notice that there's kind of a theme. It's male, female, male, female, male, female. So I and I changed them up. So Charm Charmander ended up being the female for this one. So there's Charmander. I'm gonna stop with the names because I can't remember them. And then Charizard. Oh, Charmeleon and Charizard. So, more of a fairy, um, fairy, fire, fairy type deal. Also done throughout stream. If you didn't know, I'm the humanoid Pokemon is a series for my streaming. Then you got Chikorita, Bayleaf, and at this point, my, um, my piece for my traditional live stream setup for my phone broke so you see that this isn't done but that's because I switched over to digital so you guys would have seen it as a speed paint also here you got Cyndaquil, Quilava, and Typhlosion which was really fun to do Totodile was also finished ended up being finished in stream completely so you guys would have seen the speed paint for these ones as well so these were some streaming cards that I had made uh, for when I was waiting to start the stream so welcome to the stream BRB in 15 minutes whenever I had to go make food I would put this one up and the end of the stream which I would put up uh, in the last 10 minutes of the stream this one was done this one was done for a speed paint. 
I really did enjoy this one. I, I can't remember if I gave her her name yet or not, but I had adopted her from a friend, so you guys would have seen this as a speed paint. I don't know if I did this one as a speed paint or not, but this was a random character design. I would have loved this piece if it weren't for the fact that I feel like she's too long, so I might might redo it and fix it. This one you guys would have seen as a, uh, a challenge I did on my channel, uh, a three marker challenge. I plan on redoing it, uh, either doing another one or a different type of challenge uh, soon, so you guys stay tuned for that one. This was a speed paint as well. It was the self-care speed paint. Um, you guys all know that I'm a big advocate for self-care, so make sure you guys take care of yourselves. I really did enjoy doing this piece. It was really fun. And then this one is one that I actually just finished today and I decided to include it in here because it thought it would be a little bit more easy. It's a piece for Mermaid. Um, I wish I would have recorded this one because I think it would be nice to show you guys the process for it. But I didn't because I was doing it to try to get myself out of art block. So he's actually one of my characters. I haven't given him a name yet. It's something for like a side comic just to get my name out there. Uh, type of deals. It's something I've been working on. You're going to see him in the other packages too when it comes to it. So yeah, I just finished this one today. So that'll be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure that you hit the like and the subscribe button as well as the bell to be notified. If you haven't already, head on over to my Twitch channel where I live stream every Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays usually doing art recently my art tablet just broke so right now i am live streaming minecraft so if minecraft was right down your alley come and join and watch also head over to my patreon where you can find some patreon unique rewards rewards go up usually three times a week but this week they're going up all on the same day so i want to apologize for that one right now and if you're not interested in the reward aspect of it you can always support me on my ko-fi where you can Buy me a coffee. That's it for today. Yumi Chen here. Over and out.